Hey what's up everyone, after many requests from you guys, finally I'm reviewing Sultan Rome based on CM13. It's based on CM13 stable sources and not the nightlies. So root access is not included which is kind of sad but we can flash it afterwards. OTA updates via inbuilt CM updater are available. Audio FX is also included to tweak your audio. And with lots of manual setting, Snapdragon camera is there too. It has the usual customization that you would expect like status bar, notification drawer, quick setting and also LCD density. You can basically tweak this however you want down to the very icons that appear in the status bar and what color they are. All thanks to Cyanogen Mode theme engine. Brightness slider for all lazy people out there. And before you ask, let me tell you, this room supports double tap to wake feature also. Now we have talked about customization, now let's talk about stability. I haven't seen any single F4 close and I haven't experienced a random reboot either. At least for me, this room seems to be super stable and has been working amazingly well and been my daily driver for last 3 to 4 days. Now some of you must be thinking, hey, what's so different about this room and why we should flash this one instead of official CM Nightlies? Let me just show you why. Yes, the best battery life I have ever got in my entire life. This one beated the record of 6 hours of screen on time of Dark Obez. This room is amazing as far as battery life is concerned. So I would give 4.5 out of 5 to this room. So flash if you are a heavy user and want more battery out of your smartphone. Link will be in the description for OnePlus One users. Please like and comment, it really helps the channel. And also comment that which room you want to see next week. This is Nash from Game of Rooms and I will see you next week with another room review.